वंदे गुरुपद्वंद भक्तबिंद श्री चैतन्य प्रभु वंदे नितानंद सहोदित श्री नंद नंदन वंदे राधिका चरणोदय गोपीजन सामयुक्त बिंदा मनोहर पांचा कल्पतरुवश्च के पास सिंधु बेवच पतितानंग पावने बवेशनो विभ्यो नमो नमः मुक्यं करोति वाचालं पंगुं लं खैते गिरिं यत् के पातम हंग बंदे परमानंदवादो ब्रिंदावि तुसिदे भय पियावि केशवसत Vishnavakti Bhadi Devi Sattva Bhattvai Namo Namaha Narayana Namaskritta Naroncha Ivanarottama Deving Saraswati Vyasam Tato Jayo Mudire Shankirtane Kishna Katho Padeshe Gauri Patrasya Prakasa Necha Sadanga Ptur Guru Bhakti Jukta Bhakti Pramodaksh Jagod Varun Deyam Sada Paribhavagna Mavishaduham Te Thas Padam Siva Virinjanutam Saranyam Vita Tihom Panodopal Bhavadiputam Bande Mahapurusote Charuna Vindam Yat Pada Pallavana Kachanda Manichataya Bispuruji to Kim of Yoga Dushwa Darshi Purunanu Ragra Sasagara Sara Murti Sara Dikama Ikada Kifam Karosh Se Kishna Chaitana Prabhunita Nand Shiat Jaita Gada Sarasiva Sadihi Kaura Bhakta Binda Shri Krishna Chaitanya Prabhu Nita Ananda Shri Adyaita Vada Dhara Siva Sadihi Gaura Bhakta Binda Hare Krishna Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Ram Hare Ram 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 Hare आजानुलंबित भुजाओ कनों का बदातु शंकरितानु कबितरो गमला शताक्षो विशाम बरु दिजो बरु जगधार मुपालो बंदे जगत प्रिय करो करुना भतारो हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे हरे नमामि गंगे तब पाद पंकजम सुरासुरेर बंधितो दीप बरूपम भुक्तिं चमुक्तिं चदासिनितम भावानु रूपे न सदा नरानम् गंगा तरंग रमनीय जटा कलापम् गोरी निरंतर विभुषी तबाम भागम् नारायणो प्रियम अनंगो मदा भारम् बरान सिपुरपति भजवी शनातम् बागी सजुष्ठ बदने लक्ष्मी जश्चा वक्षशी जस्यास्ते हिदे संबीत पम निशिंगा महम भजे हरे कृष्णा हरे कृष्णा 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे हरे ज 
यशात्मबुद्धि कुनपीति धातु की शादी कलत्रादि शुभों इज्जती जस्तित्व बुद्धि सलीने नकर हिचित जनेशु अभिक्येशु शायिव गोखरा जशात्मबुद्धि कुनपीति धातु की शादी कलत्रादि शुभों इज्जती यस्तित्तो बुद्धि सलीले नकर हिचित जनेशु अभिज्ञेशु शायिव गोखरा गौरीय गोष्टी बोती सीसीला भक्ति सीधां गौरीय गोष्टी बोती सीसीला भक्ति सीधां सरस्वती को स्वामी ठाकुर प्रोपाद परमहंस चकुत गुरु टोल्ड that तो that अखिल रसामृत विग्रह that श्री नंद नंदन that is the topmost thing just by doing the seva of that that under the guidance of that uh, those who are actually under the guidance of those devotees those who are actually not at all leaving the seva of govind that definitely by that we are not getting the uh, seva dikar of govind by that we are not at all getting that without taking the shelter of the devotees of krishna shila bhakti sidan saraswati ko swami thakur prabhupad paramahansa jagat guru told that do that akhil rasamrit vigrah hai of govind of bhagwan akhil rasamrit vigrah hai that shri nand nandan that is the topmost thing play think for him in that seva in order to get uh, to adopt that seva and those who are not at all doing the seva of seva of all those devotees of that definitely the govind seva is not at all possible for them who are just avoiding the seva of their devotees that those that shrimati radharani name it is uh, not at all we can find that in shrimad bhagavatam in the whole bhagavatam it is not at all possible to get the name of shrimati radharani that name of shrimati radharani in the whole bhagavatam in the very fine form it is there present in shrimad bhagavatam it is not openly we can find the name of shrimati radharani there and in shrimad bhagavat ji mahapuran what is the ultimate goal of shrimad bhagavat ji mahapuran the in the whole shrimad bhagavat ji mahapuran when we are reading the whole bhagavat ji mahapuran that uh, shrimati radharani uh, radharani we are not getting the darshan of the lotus feet of shrimati radharani then whatever that shrimad bhagavat ji mahapuran you have just said it is all gone in water that shrimati radharani that name is not at all given in bhagavatam and in shrimad that shrimad bhagavatam that shrimad radharani openly we are not getting the name of radharani and the whole bhagavatam that is all the actual center target that is the name of shrimati radharani the actual center target of shrimad bhagavat ji mahapuran is the the name of radharani that is to get the lotus feet of radharani to get the darshan of the lotus feet of radharani and to just uh, give the glorification of the lotus feet of radharani those who have just by doing se- seva of sham sundar slowly steadily slowly say by serving us just by serving govind ji and sham sundarni she has just uh, become more worshipable than govind and that govind that sham sundar is just worshiping radharani himself that's why i'm bhagwan govind ji and swam swam sundar ji is just uh, worshiping radharani by uh, by his own uh, she has become the object of worship for govind so did shrimati radharani just by getting the seva of shrimati radharani if we will be not doing the seva of radharani then then govind seva is not at all possible and those who are actually the devotees of uh, shrimati radharani that rup manjari nayan manjari etc by not following their anugatya by not following their pathway shila bhakti no thakur shila prabhupa saraswati thakur when just by leaving their seva that we will not at all getting the adhikar in govind seva at all this is not at all possible that uh, the those who are actually that whole heart of this material world is govind only the whole heart of this material world is govind apart from govind nothing is there govind ji hai 
गोविंद जी इज इज द एक्चुअल फॉर द इन्फिनिटी ब्रह्मांड ही इज द हार्ट ऑफ ऑल द इन्फिनिटी ब्रह्मांड ही इज द ओनली एक्चुअल वस्तु एक्चुअल ऑब्जेक्ट ऑफ अट्रैक्शन फॉर ऑल द इन्फिनिटी ब्रह्मांड हु इज एक्चुअली दैट होल इन्फिनिटी ब्रह्मांड द एक्चुअल आधार द कॉज ऑफ ऑल कॉजेज इज भगवान ओनली एंड दैट गोविंद जी हु इज एक्चुअली द actually the object of a whole attraction for all this infinity brahman this govind ji actually that kind of anand who is providing govind ji anand all the time and who is actually protecting govind ji all the time that is shrimati radharani that infinity brahman that the actual cause of all cause is govind and what is the actual life of govind that is shrimati radharani what she is we can't understand so that whole but the whole anand he is giving anand to that that govind ji he is giving anand to infinity brahman and that to that same govind ji that uh, uh, topmost anand that shrimati radharani is giving to her to him that is the actual urja shakti that is the topmost shakti aladini shakti that is the urja shakti of bhagwan just look by serving uh, govind ji slowly steadily she has become the object of worship for govind that is the actual hidden treasure hidden treasure of all the vedas and is the conclusive result of all the shastras guru nishtha guru nishtha shrimati radharani is actual guru bhagwan shri krishna and she is actually the guru of bhagwan shri krishna bhagwan is himself speaking this point that shrimati radharani she is my guru and guru ami shishya not jokhon joiche nachay nachi udhat radhika shri radhika rani she she is my guru that she is prem swarupa swarupa prema means that radhika rani is swayam swarupa prem radhika prem guru she is herself prem swarup and krishna has just take himself uh, give this kind of uh, uh, given relationship that uh, the shri i am actually the uh, disciple of radharani main radharani ka i am actually a disciple of radharani krishna speaking and when she is actually indicating me and just making me dance by which indication she will be dancing i am actually dancing like that this is my actual thing she is my guru and guru is that personality by that who is actually controlling who is actually controlling bhagwan also guru is that actual guru is that who is actually even controlling bhagwan also by prema she is controlling bhagwan by seva she is controlling bhagwan she is actually attracting bhagwan that is radharani guru guru anugatya that guru anugatya that guru nishtha by not having that i have already told it a lot of time before also in the shweteshwar upanishad also it is written that bhakti yatha devi tatha guru jasho deve para bhakti yatha devi tatha guru tasyite hi kachitai artha prakashant prakashant mahatmana guru nishtha nahi why not having guru nishtha inside our inside our heart hari bhajan is not at all possible and guru and bhagwan but what we actually first we actually not at all understanding this point but after that when we are getting pratishtit in bhakti then by not getting pratishtit in that then definitely bhakti in order to get maturity in bhakti it is not at all possible like uh, what kind of bhakti we have in bhagwan that kind of bhakti same we should be have in guru and when we are having more bhakti in guru that is more good this is the actual uh, the actual siddhi uh, tat of uh, bhajan and uh, gurudev vatatma guru isham gurudev vatatma evam guru pasnaik bhaktya vidya kuthare no site no dhir viprishya jiva sayamayam apramatya sangrishya atmanam atho tajya sakti tad bahut sare lot of shlokas are there actually regarding this so this gurudev atma it means gurudev 
द गुरुदेव अदात्मा इट मीन्स दैट गुरुदेव दैट गुरुदेव एंड भगवान आर नॉट डिफरेंट फ्रॉम ईच अदर एंड गुरुदेव एक्चुअली दैट आत्मा सदृश्य वी जस्ट नीड टू टेक द दर्शन ऑफ गुरुदेव लाइक दैट दैट गुरुदेव इज मोर देन माई आत्मा बाय नॉट हैविंग दिस काइंड ऑफ कंसेप्शन कृष्ण भजन इज नॉट एट ऑल पॉसिबल टू डू गुरुदेव इज नॉट एट ऑल अ मटीरियल बॉन्डेड जीवा इफ यू सम वन एक्चुअली थिंकिंग दैट गुरुदेव इज जीव इट इज नॉट एट ऑल लाइक दैट गुरु इज नॉट जीवा गुरु कैनॉट बी जीव गुरु इज एक्चुअली ईश्वर स्वयं ही स्वयं भगवान समटाइम्स गुरु वैष्णव दैट बाई टेक सींग द आदर शाचर ऑफ गुरुदेव सम वन एक्चुअली थिंकिंग रॉन्ग अबाउट दैम लाइक वंशीदास बाबा जी महाराज द आचरण ऑफ इट इज वेरी डिफिकल्ट टू अंडरस्टैंड हिज आचरण वेरी डिफिकल्ट वॉट शी ही इज डूइंग एट वॉट टाइम इट इज वेरी इम्पॉसिबल टू अंडरस्टैंड गौर किशोर दास बाबा जी महाराज यू सी एंड वैन यू विल गो टू दैम दे डेफिनेटली यू विल बी फाइंडिंग फॉल्ट इन दैम डेफिनेटली यू विल बी फाइंडिंग फॉल्ट वॉट दे आर एक्चुअली डूइंग यू डोंट नो समाइम दे आर यूजिंग स्लैग लैंग्वेज ऑल्सो इट इज ऑलरेडी रिटर्न दे आर इन द लाइफ हिस्ट्री That Baba Ji Maharaj actually speaking, you have come here that for this. No, he is just using slang language after that, and he is using foul words in front of him, and he just oh, you to avoid them. So Guru Dev, he is not at all Jeev. Guru is actually Ishwar. He is Bhagwan Swayam. That's why Guru Dev is actually is called Guru Dev Atma. That's why Guru Dev is called a Devata. He is more than demi god, and Guru Dev is Atma. He is that Priti Patra. He is the pot of Priti. That Atma, my Atma is Sadrishya. By speaking like this, it doesn't mean that he is my Atma. It is not like that. That Priti Patra, he is a pot of Priti is there. Like Bhagwan Shri Krishna speaking to Uddhav Ji Maharaj, he is speaking to uh, about Uddhav Ji Maharaj. That Uddhav. There is not at all even a uh, single difference of hair. What is Uddhav? He is me. Means Krishna and Uddhav are not different from it. It means achintya bedan tatva. This kind of priti vishe. It is like that. It is shown here. So much actually his dearer that I am actually Uddhav and Krishna. Means there is oneness with them, not different from each other. So it is actually the pot of priti. What actually Bhagwan showing in front of us regarding Uddhav, who is actually thinking of Gurudev as Ishwar. those who are actually thinking gurudev as ishwar those who are thinking gurudev as bhagwan bhagwan or ishwar himself then definitely they are not by uh, by spe- speaking that uh, he is actually ishwar he is realizing that point himself those who are actually getting the realization that uh, guru uh, guru is actually ishwar he is getting that realization then definitely he is that gurudev atma That jiva is Guru Dev Atma. That Guru Dev Atma, this jiva Atma. That if someone is there like this, then those who are actually the devotees like this, then definitely they are called. They are not different from Guru Dev. These disciples are actually called not different from Guru Dev. Those who is how Guru Dev is, he is actually become one with Guru Dev. His all qualities and symptoms. That kind of pathway of Guru Dev Atma. That kind of Guru Bhakt. Guru devotee is actually there in this material world, and definitely he will definitely get the hundred percent kripa of Guru kripa. He will get that in his life. Definitely he will get that in his life. Krishna Prashta Shri Guru Dev and Guru Nisht devotees is becoming very happy towards Guru Nisht devotees. That Krishna Prashta Guru Dev who is there. If he is actually thinking that there is one disciple who is full of nista for Guru Dev, he has become very happy with them. That's why uh, to get the that the actual pran, the actual life of uh, Guru Dev, that Krishna, he is also actually giving that Guru Dev actually is definitely getting happy. But at the same time, if Guru Dev is happy, that's why Krishna is also getting happy with his activities of that Guru Prest disciple. Like in the same way that Guru Dev Atma disciple, he is actually becoming happy. Krishna is also becoming happy with them. Hari Guru Vishnu, these three, these are the three major platform. They have a, such a platform that if you are having some kind of differences, you are the differentiation you are creating, then it is not at all good. That how Hari Guru and Vishnu, 
he will be differentiation and he will just get destroyed by having this differentiation in his mind gurudev is in between and bhagwan is at one point and one side guru is in between bhagwan is at one side bhagwan and vaishnav they are actually just taking in his lap means that i just want to you just want to understand that it is just like only one tatva guru is in between and bhagwan actually is just taking vaishnav he just want to take it in the lap in his own lap bhagwan is taking them just taking in his lap and uh, just sitting there that who is guru that is definitely hari and who is hari that is guru in any condition whatsoever guru pad mother we have to uh, get the happiness of gurudev we just need to make gurudev happy that's it that we just need to make gurudev happy we need we need to seek the happiness of gurudev that's it we are actually we are actually just uh, we just need to uh, make sure that we are just firmly uh, we are just firmly just uh, taking the lotus feet of gurudev firmly we just need to having that uh, guru charan that uh, with very strongly and rigidly we just need to uh, 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 take the guru charan by this what will happen that bhagwan and devotee kripa definitely will come automatically to you by just uh, when the gurudev is happy that that shri hari and shri vaishnav gan all are becoming happy with that but this kind of prasang is coming but when you are actually not becoming gurudev atma and you are not getting that eligibility to become gurudev atma you are not at all becoming this kind of pathway of gurudev atma you are not at all eligible you are not becoming successful to attain that pathway then you are not becoming giving your whole life and soul for your gurudev and you are not at all thinking that gurudev is my life by this when you are not at all thinking like this then everything will go in water in soil and if you will be having this kind of material uh, uh, mind regarding gurudev then everything will be go it everything will get destroyed jasho sakshat bhagavati gyan deep prade guru mato shadhi shutam tasyo sarvam kunya raso chuka iska hati ka snan ka it is just like equal to by uh, taking a bath of an elephant 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 is just taking bath for a very long time and after that what is doing whatever actually there is dust particle is there he is just again uh, taking it on his body this is the actual condition of those who are actually thinking gurudev on a material platform so definitely you will be getting the kipa of bhagavat devotees the bhagwan and hari definitely if you will be just be taking uh, st- uh, you will taking the lotus feet of gurudev and if it you are not at all taking the lotus feet of gurudev then you that bhagwat seva you will will be absent in you you will be getting away from bhagwat seva by just hearing this kind of bhakti siddhant siddhant of bhakti and he is getting that kind of uh, unhappiness in his mind then maharaj actually this kind of uh, capacity we don't have to hear so that's why that uh, this uh, a glorification of gurudev and gurudev atma just by getting that gurudev atma what you are speaking this is actually just uh, very unhappy for us whether we can do this or not and up till what point we can do we don't have this capacity to do and it is our actually ill luck that we can't do this kind of strict rules and regulations to follow them it is very impossible for us to follow so that's why prabhupad speaking in this relation prabhupad just becoming very sad and unhappy because they are actually not at all digesting the siddhant that's why prabhupad actually become very unhappy and speaking that that my actually luck is very bad you don't have anything to come but my luck is very bad prabhupad speaking prabhupad becoming very happy and speaking after that he is speaking that uh, inside his heart he is prabhupad speaking that this my luck is very bad what is your actual fault in that this is my fault that is my luck is bad prabhupad speaking that i have given you a lot of things by hari katha i have just spoken all the siddhant in front of you but still there is who where is that person who can just accept this all these kind of tatva siddhant he can accept 
who is actually actually accepting this kind of siddhant who has just taken this like my heart only he is taking sometimes prabhupad also used to speak like this that uh, that is by just hearing so much hari katha and doing so much kirtan and by just speaking that kalyan kalpatru kirtan and sharnagati kirtan is doing so much siddhant he has just heard after that also he has just left me and just gone away from me he has just like he is just getting attracted towards maya devi that was so much attraction for maya devi he has that he has just left me you see so this is my actual my bad luck is there that my behavior etiquette is not at all that much good that i can't even stop them this is my actual fault in me only by this prabhupad always used to speak like this with a very sad and unhappy mood prabhupad actually always used to get disappointed by speaking like this this is my actually ill luck what is their actual fault they don't have any fault this is my ill luck by the shlok which i have already started with that is a very important shloka prabhupad actually speaking in shrimad bhagavad ji mahapuran one shlok prabhupad actually taking it of one shlok of shrimad bhagavad ji mahapuran prabhupad ji actually just explaining us that you see that those who have their intention is just getting on this material body made of blood and flesh this body material body which is made this is so bad smell and filthy body full of smell actually this we are actually getting attracted towards that by those those people who are apna who have that cut in their in this body made of blood and flesh this sack of blood and flesh this material body this body material body which is made of blood and flesh in this body those who are having this kind of uh, false doership that this is my body this kind of thinking they have those people those jivas bonded jivas and they are going do all the big big teeth that this kind of water they are actually having that normal water is there in all the teeth they are actually not getting the glorification of teeth they don't want to understand that and that this kind of vichar is not at all coming in their mind that this is just a normal water this is not teeth and and just to get uh, in all the teeth are just getting one uh, very normal uh, kind of uh, mind and in your body just getting that atma buddhi if this kind of vichar is coming then jash atma buddhi guna pe tidhatu e rakt mansa that this uh, body made of blood and flesh this kind of material body which is so filthy and full of smell which we can marrow it means it is just becoming is who is actually staying in uh, uh, the chemical in ground this material body who have that thing that atma buddhi in this material body and uh, he is speaking that he is my own son all relatives are mine and my own wife he is getting attracted towards that more and he is this kind of this this is my wife this kind of uh, doership that this is my wife this is my son this is my relatives like this this kind of uh, mind feeling is there inside him e jo this pani mein tirth jat that is the, all the tirth tirthas is having a normal thinking that this is just a normal water this is not a tirth and in uh, bhagavad devotees he is not at all having any kind of prema for them and inside his heart no respect for uh, pure guru vishnu he don't have any respect for them he is actually just like a pokhar he is actually more uh, fallen than the dump ass they are actually just more fallen than the garud ass dump ass they are actually more fallen than those ass are there no they are more uh, uh, fallen than those horse and dumb bears more fallen than them so material uh, uh, mind is there do so much materialistic thought is there regarding their body bodily conception so like this 
this kind of vichar actually is there in inside us and and these people what kind of mangal they will get in their life that is the actual question arising what kind of uh, mangal uh, they will get some mangal will they will get no i don't think so those having so fallen condition so for, for rubbish concept they have uh, rubbish vichar about no no kind of attraction for uh, guru vishnu no respect for them for guru vishnu what something can be done for them no, not at all they are actually gokhar gokhon means they are ass they are just more fallen than ass so like this now actually this kind of vichar which is coming rupa goswami pad ji actually rupa goswami pad ji has just told this point that golok the topmost place of golok means that uh, this golok is just like a lotus flower and uh, in brahm samhita also we can find this shloka in brahm samhita also it is written kamalam gokulaksha madam mahat padam tat karani kaharam tat anantansha sambhava ye padma phul jaisa this is just like a lotus flower and uh, the core point of that lotus flower in that uh, there are actually minerals like small small buds are there that topmost devotee is that who was full of ras that is the topmost uh, uh, center point shrimati radharani is there that prabhupada i have already started with this shlok that in all the shrimad bhagavad ji mahapurat when you are just reading the whole shrimad bhagavad ji mahapuran that shrimati radharani's name to find that out is very uh, difficult but those who who are rasik devotees and who are actually paramans devotees that uh, in each and every nerves and impulse of bhagavatam the name of radharani is there everywhere but we are not at all finding that because we have that material thinking but in shrimad bhagavad ji mahapuran radharani name is there definitely naam is a very far distant very normal thing the name of radharani is not at all normal the name of radharani in shrimad bhagavad is not at all big thing but that is the most big thing is that that the topmost target of all the bhagavad ji mahapuran the total bhagavatam the glories of shrimati radharani and in that only we are just like an as we are not at all finding the name of radharani then from which point i can uh, which up till which point i can go what does it mean actually what does it mean actually in sanskrit anaya that by har by har it means by har that tritya vibhakti is there that third case ending by that by whom this actually is there written that anaya radhito that by har that paratpar akileshwar nanda nandan shri krishna is actually top most aradhit is worshipable by her radharani by that top most nandanand krishna is just getting a worshipable by that aradhit aradhit means worshipable that by that krishna seva is uh, uh, done in the top most way by more and more uh, that kind of seva serving attitude can be done apart from that nothing is top most than that thing that name is radharani when we are actually just hearing all the bhagavatam and just by reading bhagavatam we are not at all getting the name of radha and then what what actually have got in in conclusion in result nothing the topmost place of the maduras uh, and the, all the rasik devotees that topmost place is sri radha kund i have already have just uh, spoken that shri laru goswami pad has just accepted that by different shlokas he has just given the instruction in front of us सरसी 
This is the topmost thing. That in this infinity Brahmand, when you will be searching, that Sri Radha Kund, no, no place is there that is more topmost than Radha Kund. Radha Kund is the most topmost place in the whole infinity Brahmand. Nothing can get compared with that. Nothing can get compared like Radha Rani. Nobody is there like Radha Rani. That is the topmost uh, uh, dearer and nearer one, Sri Mati Radha Rani to Krishna. Those who are actually those who are actually the topmost uh, lucky luckiest person that uh, those who are those who are those who are actually getting that aprakrit radha kund they are getting a place there that with that aprakrit chitvritti not like that uh, they are actually staying in shri radha kund and uh, just by getting that uh, made of a sack of blood of blood and flesh this uh, stool and urine this body this body material body cannot stay there that this like stool and uh, stool and urine this kind of sack of body this is just a sack of body it cannot stay in radha kund at all that slow filthy and dirty body cannot stay in radha kund Prabhupada actually that's why speaking that you see that Srimati Radha Rani that and Sri Radha Kund is not different from each other and uh, Sri Mati Radha Rani is, uh, uh, is actually dearer to Krishna in the same way Sri Radha Kund also is uh, s- the same way is uh, uh, nearer and dearer to Krishna and those who are having the most luckiest person in this material infinity Brahman that they are actually just getting a place uh, that at the Sri Radha Kund and with that uh, Chinmay and Aprakrichit Vritti they are staying at the place of Sri Radha Kund and uh, they are actually seeing the actually Ashtakala Lele of Sri Ra- Radha Govind and all the time they are just thinking and doing the bhajan of that Ashtakala Lele that is the topmost bhajan apart from that nothing is topmost where actually which place is there in this whole material world whatever is there in this whole three material worlds where for up till what point we will go all these lok they are actually just like full of enjoyment it is just like this it is just easy to speak that whatever sanskar you have previously according to that where actually you will be going that accordingly uh, and where you will be just uh, going there whether you in the bhur bhuva swaha or in Swarg Lok, or where it all depends upon your Karamphal. That Bhu Lok means that uh, this uh, earth, that's Devi Dham. Bhu means that Antariksh. After that, Swarg Lok is there. Now, all these three Lokas, those who are household devotees there, household persons, those who are getting doing good deeds, good, uh, good perishable deeds. For them, that kind of, especially those who are householders, that is the actual place for them. That's Swarga. And apart from that, if you go more up than uh, Swarga Lok, then these kind of four Loks, that they, those who are getting the household life and who haven't got that household uh, uh, Varna Ashram Dharm in the household life, they are not at all enjoying that. Maybe that is also an enjoying uh, uh, object for them. When you'll go to Brahmlog, when you'll go to Swarglog, what kind of different kind of enjoyments are there? You can't even expect. So that is also a place of enjoyment. What is above uh, Swarglog? Those who are actually not at all household devo- household householders, they are actually Vanaprasti, and that Nastik Brahmachari going to Janlok, and Vanaprasti going to Tapalok, and. Upagarmi Brahmachari Mahalok is going. Nastik Brahmachari going to Upagarmi Mahalok they are going. Nastik Brahmachari they are going to Janalok. Vanprasti going to Satyalok. So all and Sanyasi that actual Sanyasi is there. That who is an actual Sanyasi they are just taking a wish of Sanyasi is not like that. Those who have actually taken sannyas in their life, actual sannyas, that but those sannyasis, they will be going to the Satya Lok. That is the enjoying uh, place for them. In the Gita also we can see that Bhagavan has just told to, to Arjun that Arjun Arjun that from Brahma till the insect, all actually are going in this cycle of birth and death. All, everyone. And where actually there is Sidranam Chidatma, that Vakunt Dham, that is all for those Mukta, Mukta, that is more rare for those Mukta people also, those who have got Mukti. 
that is also most rare, rare thing for those persons as well that vaikunth dham those who, devotees who are actually bhagavat parshad they are just to get leaving their body immediately by leaving their material body they are just getting devotees these devotees get that those who are bhagavat bhaktadan just by leaving their body immediately they just get transferred to that vaikunth particular vaikunth lok that they just go to that particular vaikunth lok that this vaikunth that apart from that the topmost place is mathura that i will told mathura is the topmost place than vaikunth lot of shlokas we have already just discussed this i have already discussed this shloka so this uh, vaikunth more topmost than that mathura is the more topmost place and apart from mathura that raslila khetri in vrindavan what is there it is most topmost and apart from that giriraj maharaj who is actually the topmost servant of bhagwan is more topmost place than vrindavan raslila who is actually just uh, getting for 7 days and 7 nights giriraj maharaj who is just uh, getting onto the tone to point of the finger and uh, the top most uh, mysterious and uh, very hidden secret seva of bhagwan radha govind that's why in giriraj govardhan that kind of radha govind ji is taking vilas all the time and uh, top most uh, very nice place is that giriraj maharaj is a top most nice place for radha govind leela and leela krida this actually shloka is there already written that this giriraj maharaj actually is the top most of of, of all that's why giriraj maharaj that is the top most servant of bhagwan it is already considered that kandar kandamul that was very sweet that kandamul that is, it is there in the hills you can find that kandamul that one sadhu has just brought one uh, that fruit i have just taken it very lost lot of days before this is very sweet so sweet so so big it is just like a coconut uh, tree also it is just more than that how he has just taken that i don't know and he has just given it to me you just eat this and i have just taken it so nice and sweet so this kandamul this kind of fruit this kandamul means mool means kandamul etc fruits etc and the uh, that uh, caves of caves to stay and spring for water and cows are just going all the way and just taking grass apart from giriraj nothing is more topmost gar giriraj maharaj up till that no nothing is topmost than that and and that's why giriraj maharaj has just radha govind that the jugal sarkar what kind of seva he hasn't done so much seva he has done day and night he is serving radha govind whether it's water whether it's kandamul fruit is there or whatever other things are there everything he has just arranged for radha govind seva and whatever bhagwan shri krishna is just taking rest in the caves with all the all the all his friends and sometimes radha govind ji actually just doing a kind of krida leelas they are just kind of different leelas they have to are actually doing there in govardhan so like this giriraj maharaj bhagwan shri krishna actually just giving the glorification of giriraj ji maharaj very nice very sweet seva topmost seva govardhan is but more topmost than that that shri radha kund is more topmost than govardhan because because there is some special thing is there unique there that nandan nandan krishna bhagwan shri krishna he is actually just getting the flood of prema there that flood of prema shri nandan nandan shri krishna is just uh, getting there in shri radha kund and prabodhana saraswati pal saraswati pad has just told in uh, gaur leela radha kund mihapi radha kund mihapi gopalapati he premam premam mrita plavanat ye prem ka bar that prem the flood of prem amrit has just come prabodhana saraswati pad has also spoken this point that uh, that whole world actually just going into the flood of prema but only me i am just uh, i am the only one who nothing has happened to me chaitanya 
चंद प्रकटे प्रबोधन सरस्वती पास जस्ट क्राइंग लाइक दैट सो गिरिराज महाराज ओके स्टॉप मोस्ट दिस वॉट सेवा गिरिराज महाराज हेज डन वी कैन नॉट कंपेयर दैट सेवा विद एनी विद एनी थिंग एल्स दैट्स वाई इन भागवत जी महापुराण दैट गिरिराज इज स्पोकन देयर इट एक्चुअली वन नेम इज गिवन टू गिरिराज महाराज इज हरिदास वर्ज दैट इज टॉप मोस्ट आउट ऑफ ऑल द हरिदास वॉट एवर द हरिदास वो आर द सर्वेंट ऑफ हरी There are more sir. Uddhav Uddhav Ji Maharaj is also called Hari Das Varya. He is also servant of Har Hari. But uh, inside Vrindavan, what vichar is there? So nice. That Giriraj Maharaj, where actually Radha Govind is actually doing their krida, their lila, and uh, Ram Krishna, Balram Balram Ji Maharaj and Krishna are just doing their lila. Krishna Balram, those who are actually Krishna and Balram, actually doing their uh, giving their lotus feet on the head of Giriraj Maharaj everywhere, and Shri Mati Radha Rani Seva, that is also Giriraj Maharaj is topmost there. So this Radha Kund is the topmost, and in Radha Kund and Radha Rani, that is not not different from each other. That why Rupa Swami was speaking. That if someone wants to who has done bhajan in his life in actual and he has just get that realization about that here kriti means kriti here means that those who have done actually bhajan and have realized that tatta and what kriti kriti means that who has just got successful in his bhajan who has just got that thing after successful bhajan that is called kriti. Not of meanings are there of kriti like Keshav Goswami Maharaj has kriti ratna his title. His Ratna, that is the diamond. He has done so much seva, so much seva that he has become Kriti Ratan. Just by his doing seva, slowly steadily has become seva moy. Kriti means successful. Kriti, Kritartha, all these words are coming. So, this Kriti Ratna, Maharaji, Ma Kesha Goswami Maharaj got this name. That is an actual name, Kriti Ratna. He is actually Kriti Ratna. And Rup Goswami Pad actually is speaking that Kriti is there any was uh, those who have actually understand bhajan and has just realized that in his in their life if some many person is there. Is there anyone like this who has done bhajan and just realized that? That's why Sri Rup Goswami Pad speaking that. Sarasi means that like a pond, this Radha Kund, which is the just a, a pond, Radha Kund, that Kund, that who is that most luckiest person? That he is actually at this corner of this Radha Kund. This actually Radha Rani. And the kund of Radha Rani, that Sharasi, that kund, who is actually that rasik devotee, who is just become a topmost uh, luckiest, who is at the corner of that Radha kund, getting a place there, in the Ashtakali Lila of Radha Govind. Is there anyone who is actually taking a place, the place at Radha kund? It means that the topmost place is Radha kund. There is no other place more topmost than Radha kund. So Radha Kund, Radha Kund is the topmost place. A lot of things are there, and we will be having a lot of discussion regarding this. And here, actually, Prabhu is speaking that in Vakuntha, in Vakunt, that kind of Maryada Mai uh, Seva is actually going on with full of opulences. That uh, Seva Maryada Mai Seva is actually going on in Vakunt, but in Vrindavan. When you will go inside the Vrindavan, that Maryada don't have that much value. It has actually Vrindavan is such a place 
where actually it is written about that place in of vrindavan it is already written it's already written vishwamb seva is different in that vishwamb seva that is just done by your life and maryada vai seva is also have some limitation that it, you just have need to have some rules and regulation regarding that but vishwamb seva don't have any kind of rules and regulation seva is seva there is actually no kind of restriction or barriers in the seva so that is vishwamb seva vishwamb seva that is has more speciality than maryada seva and after just leaving your body whatever this body gave me given by our material mother and father everything will go away and then we will be going whatever actually some where actually no barrier is there in that seva which is going on continuously apratiha what is that apratiha seva what do you mean by apratiha seva in that seva there is actually no kind of obstruction or barrier in that दैट परमेश्वर स्वतंत्र पुरुषोत्तम परात पर अखिलेश्वर भगवान इज एक्चुअली इच्छा मई ही इज लीला मई एंड इज आनंद मई एंड ही हैज दैट इंडिपेंडेंस ऑफ दिस विल ऑफ भगवान दैट दैट्स वाई ही इज डूइंग दिस काइंड ऑफ लीला दोज हु हैव दिस काइंड ऑफ इंडिपेंडेंस इंडिपेंडेंट भाव इन देयर बॉडी एंड दे आर एक्चुअली जस्ट गेटिंग इन टू दिस सप्टल एंड फाइन बॉडी and whatever there is restrictions and rules and regulation there definitely they have to do you have to do this you have to do this they have to do that in order to get to that platform and those who all those mahatmas and all those paramhans mahajans those who have become nitya siddh and they uh, for those sadhan sindh there is not at all any uh, thing to do for them and those who have just already got out of this um, bondage of material bondage so that's why i have just told you one shlok of pravodana saraswati pad that today what is actually bondage for us you do to need to do this you need to to follow this rules and regulation this that it is all actually those all those paramhans nitya seva all the time they are doing uh, seva nitya seva and vinda one those for paramhans for those paramhans these rules and regulations are not at all there they already have got out of that that's why there all these shlokas are there actually and after that there are more shlokas regarding this that whatever rules and regulations are there this uh, this radha rani and gopikas whatever the rules and regulations is barrier you will give you just need to go don't you don't go there and you and you have to go there at this time to if you will put restriction in them then definitely it is not good for them because they are already there uh, in the uh, deep ocean of seva those whose character behavior and is heart it is not at all controlled they in order to regulate that that strict rule and regulations are required but in his but those in their life that seva is everything for them for they what kind of restriction you will be putting them there is no kind of restriction at all they are actually out of restriction no that's why pravodana saraswati pad ji has just told that they they are actually beyond all rules and regulations those paramans vaishnavas all those vedic rules and regulations and all those materials uh, adar shastra and all material things everything is there this is actually all uh, whatever achar and acharan niyam rules and regulations it is all for uh, those premi devotees it will just become a disturbance for them that will become a disturbance for them what they they can do that's why this uh, in their life that this kind of seva mood they haven't got in their life for them these kind of vidhi rules and regulations are there can i just give some sasan to paramans guru vishnu no not at all it is not possible these rules and regulations will not apply on them and prabhupad ji has spoken a lot of time prabhupad has spoken a lot of time that sadhan 
एंड सिद्धि इन इन दैट प्लेटफॉर्म ऑन दैट प्लेटफॉर्म साधन एंड सिद्धि दैट साधक हु इज डूइंग साधन दैट काइंड ऑफ साधन एंड द सिद्धि स्टेज दैट प्लेटफॉर्म देर इज एक्चुअली सम कन्फ्यूजन विफ इट्स क्रिएटिंग देयर दैन जीव कैन बिकम अ प्राकृत सहजिया प्रभात एक्चुअली स्पोक स्पीकिंग दिस पॉइंट सो दिस एक्चुअली दिस सहजिया पीपल फॉर दैम फॉर ऑल दिस सहजिया पीपल वॉट इज देयर दैट दिस सब दिस फाइन बॉडी एंड सप्टल बॉडी जस्ट इन ऑर्डर टू गेट इन साइड दैट He is actually just in bondage till now. He is actually in the bondage of this subtle and the fine body. He is busy with that. He is already there in the bondage of subtle and fine body. And in this in this uh, swarup, if he'll be just be thinking of that aprakrit transcendental lila, and I'll thinking that he is a topmost paramhans, then he will become a prakrit sahajya. He will become prakrit sahajya, nothing else. Uh, any person of the whole material world if you can pick up e- even they, those who have already come in the bhajan life also who is just doing drama of bhajan or having the 50% perfection or having 80% perfection for everyone it is like that those who have come in bhajan for them this uh, this uh, topmost anantamay rasmay jagat this material world for this material world it is impossible to understand this material ras jagat that all over all over sahityik of this material world sahityik means uh, whatever all the philosophers of this material world and uh, all those pandits or those who are uh, all big big people are there of this material world or philosophers and those who are discovery scientists everyone in their in their theory theoretical portion definitely there will be some fault in that maybe they can just be speaking about the rasatattva like kalidas he is that mahakavi kalidas also speaking about the rasatattva in this material world there is actually a very famous this kind of uh, poet he has said kai gaint so much of famous in this material world why kalidas kavi is the topmost why because he has just got the kripa of saraswati devi he has just written this kind of poem that in the standard of this uh, uh, material world this is the topmost what is the standard of this material world according to that standard he can be that he can get the topmost position why because uh, he is because his writings are actually on the material platform in the ma class also you can just uh, about the uh in calcutta university you can find uh, the poems of kalidas you just need to uh, go through those poems so whatever the poems uh, what he has kalidas has written and prabhupad actually just uh, giving us this kind of vichar that they are actually a big writer big material writer so much name fame they have just got in their life that in order to defeat them it is next to impossible but uh, they are actually their ras tatva in the books they have just written mega megdoot kumar sangam this kind of different books kalidas has just written kalidas ji has just written a lot of books but in these books uh, when you will be just having this kind of vichar after uh, 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 reading vaishnav will be just finding a lot of faults in his books what he has written like i'll give you one example that what kind of rasatva is so serious in in depth discussion is there whether big big philosophers or writers are there still they will maybe a big philosopher is there in their life there is no at all any perfection why because they don't know anything where actually we don't have any idea they have a limit limited mind so that's why prabhupad given one example prabhupad speaking you see that he is such a big writer and uh, those uh, whole material people are just giving him the aarti and all the material people are worshiping him even in the foreign country also the ka- writings of kalidas everyone is actually uh, reading in every university and our geeta also so in some university they are actually just reading as a subject matter so this is a topmost thing they are actually reading geeta as a syllabus definitely they just know to do the question answer about geeta but where that realization will come their teacher actually he, he don't have his own realization so how he can give realization to them so this kind of uh, uh, thing has already done in the life that from our india on top class uh, sadhu i don't want to speak his name he is from is not from godiamat and his writing 
he is good he is just externally is good but still inside his heart lot of things are actually there uh, he is a big so much big writer so much big writer that he is not from godiamat but he is very famous very important uh, and i have already seen his writing in his writing his writing is very very good there is not at all any problem in writing but in between in between there is actually some fault in that so nice writing actually there so darshanik uh, vichar is there but in between some fault is there that paramans ji has just told this and avivekanand has just spoken like this actually they haven't understand bhakti so nice writing actually is writing but he don't know actually what is bhakti but uh, he actually went to the foreign country in new york university here there everywhere and he always used to give uh, classes also he is a doctorate but they are actually whatever the professors of their whatever their conception of comment on gita about the comment whatever they have on gita by just hearing that you will just get surprised and amazed of uh, their professor what kind of uh, uh, foolish vichar they have they don't have any idea they are thinking that dharma khetra kurse is actually nothing is there in that hmm. they actually thinking nothing is that in this shlok that what is actually starting to the shlokas of gita they are thinking that nothing is there in this shlok oh, all rubbish but whatever the actual mystery in that those who have got the full kipa of gita then definitely they will, must be knowing this otherwise no other one can know so this person has which has gone he is also a vaishnav he has done the work of acharya also but still i have seen in his writing that so much fault is there in his writing how it is possible that he is such a famous writer but still actually this paramas ji is speaking like and this avivekanand ji has just speaking like this and is if someone actually no shuddha bhakti is there inside his mind then how he can write this kind of thing so whatever is there you just leave that and this kalidas ji i am actually speaking about propat speaking that you see kalidas is such a famous writer but still in his uh, writing you can see about meghdoot kumar sambhav propat ji speaking that granth ka shuruaat that in the starting of the in the starting of the granth gauri sankaru bande bande pitaro bande pitaro bande pitaro gauri shankaro means that uh, he is just like my mother and father i will be just giving the uh, before the starting of the book i will be just uh, glorifying my mother and father it is actually very important here maybe some places it is written like he has that he has just got the kripa of saraswati devi and someone here it is written that he has got the kripa of devi maya or both of them he has got the kripa and what is actually true and what is false i don't want to recognize that but actually someone speaking they have got saraswati kripa and someone actually speaking devi kripa whatever is there is there but there is actually very important point in this it means that i am actually just glorifying my mother and father who that i also have my mother father they are shankar and parvati gauri shankar that i am just glorifying my mother and father then uh, if you are glorifying mother father then you just need to do with some manner you just need to do that so what is actually how you can do like this for like, that you are actually speaking gauri shankar as your mother father then uh, for that you will be just uh, doing the the whatever the darshan of for the kaam vichar you will be having for mother father you are just writing bande pitro gauri shankar okay you are actually thinking that they are mother father but still after that whatever the mother father they are actually doing in secret that kaam you don't need to speak about that we don't have this adhikar so this prabhupad actually you see what kind of fault he has done so much big writer he is so famous writer after writing this he don't rasaba siddhant which are nothing is he has that is the actual material writer like this so prabhupad actually speaking kavya prakash sahitya darpan all actually this alankar shastra either i also have this kind of but i don't have any time to read sahitya darpan alankar everything i have chand shastra but where is the time to read them and what i will just get by reading them also i don't don't want to become a big lecturer i don't want to become a big writer and poet this kavya prakash sahitya darpan alankar shastra everything is these are actually chand shastra they are having all material relationship by this what will happen maximum to maximum 
in this one material world that uh, that hero topmost hero and hero in uh, uh, they are actually material hero and hero in this kind of uh, conversation is just given in mahabharat also it is written nal damyanti what is this manal and damyanti they what is in this material world the according to the material which are laila majnu's prem is the topmost and in foreign country in england it's come romeo juliet jim della but they have the topmost prema so which has the topmost prem and which has the topmost prem that is actually material standard this prem actually having material this is not at all an ideal uh, standard in material world they can understand that but this is not an ideal standard there is only one which are in this that this material body that who has just taken a form of girl and another material body has taken a form of boy hero and heroine so just like this only the full filthy and dirty body this just a sack of blood and flesh which are just we are speaking we have spoken a lot of time about this point i have spoken a lot of time about this point that this is nothing just nothing in this material body just sack of blood and flesh that's it swabhava durgandhi vinindhitantare kale vare mutte purish bhavite he ramante moola viramante pandita amit purne amit purne krimikita sankule amit purne krimikita sankule swabhava durgandhi vinindhitantare kale vare mutte purish bhavite ramante moola those who are foolish those who have don't have any kind of mind this kind of vichar we have done this is for material persons this is actually for material persons that uh, those who are actually doing uh, prem and that uh, there is what is the actual uh, uh, conclusive result in that i am actually speaking today in the morning also in arikatha that uh, that all this material world all this material world is it is what 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 is it is running for it is actually running for maya for this material maya it is running it don't have any kind of feeling for chit vastu i have just given one example regarding this today in the morning only i was just speaking about this point that you see in nepal there is amrapali in nepal in one place is there that is very nice lady amrapali named so beautiful that about uh, nobody is so beautiful than amrapali uh, maybe you can see that in the whole country that uh, this kind of, uh, of girl is so beautiful in not only in his in his country that whatever neighboring countries are also there who are the kings there they are just taking a very hidden form just by uh, hiding their actual swarup they are actually just coming to take the darshan of amrapali and after that what happened that the king saw that uh, the government of that country that's uh, at that time uh, that the king king ship was there there is no government the king actually has just saw that uh, thousands of uh, th- our uh, only uh, for one lady thousands of lives will get destroyed at that at the at the last king has just taken that she is just a national pros he is declared a national pros who everyone can go to her by appointment she can go to her it means that that whatever the actually the kings of this and prime ministers of this uh, world they are actually running for that lady but this lady amra pali this lady amra pali this body actually after just leaving her body and is just taking a birth in a tribal family and so very black looking and someone will actually fight for that no not at all you can understand that amra pali if but she, she is actually leaving this body present body because it this is one kind of curse that this kind of beautifulness she has this becomes a curse for her life for her whole life and this uh, actually amra pali she is actually leaving this beautiful body and after that taking a birth in a tribal uh, family and so if some someone will just uh, fight for that so just have this kind of vichar that for what you are fighting you are just fighting for matter that's it 
this is the actual thing no you are a matter is uh, that beautiful lady has this matter and that uh, person who is running for that beautiful lady they are uh, this is also matter so matter is running for matter so both are fighting for each other and there is another a lot of shlokas are there regarding this that our raja tamo raja tamo they are actually fighting with these what i can do they all those uh, top spear guru vishnu they are seeing this thing only they are seeing that uh, one person is so much tamo guni and he is actually fighting with the raja guni person oh fighting is there just cross uh, cross exchange of words is going on with them who is actually fighting with whom <laughs> atma is not at all fighting with anyone atma actually is not at all fighting with anyone so this body which is actually given by this prakriti this body this is actually fighting is going on with them you can see this one gun one gun is actually just uh, colliding colliding with the other gun this fighting this actually fighting of gun is going on why should i go in that so it is a very in depth discussion the propa speaking you see these people actually not understanding this point that they are thinking that i am a very big i am a very big darshanik i am a very big scientist i am a big philosopher so okay whatever you are but you are actually from this material world only you are not at from you don't have any thing a touch of transcendentalness in you inside you from where you can touch that a prakrit jagat this actually whatever in this material world it is going out as rasa tattva whatever all actually is material everything is material it is having that actual thing is not at all there in uh, back side of that but that golok vrindavan that is the topmost a prakrit five rasas are there in full in toto there by body touch speech everything that five kind of uh, ras rasa are available in this material world also rasa is available and we are running for that only without ras no one can just live, live. in the shastras also Uh, speaking that uh, uh, someone can just uh, live without ras ras is there definitely that kind of uh, hope of living life is there we have that desire to live more if there is no ras then even even a mosquito also is just living just he is running for ras he also need need new 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 kind of blood and one shukar and shukri that they also pig and uh, female pig they also want kind of another ras they need new new kind of uh, a uh, new new stool and urine and this uh, female uh, pig is wants the association of male is uh, pig without ras no ras nobody can stay in this material world whatever someone is speaking but if this kind of vichar that in depth discussion is going on without ras nobody can stay but at at up till what uh, point we will be just uh, uh, just tasting this kind of ras up till that point when that kind of transcendental ras is not at all coming that transcendental rasa is not at all going by getting that a prakrit ras that prakrit ras will offer or we will automatically uh, kick that out that is the actual rules so that pun rajya in that that the, for, there are five ras there are the five ras and these are actually all five ras are material ras and it is all actually polluted but that it is just a perverted reflection of that transcendental ras this is just a perverted reflection of those transcendental ras that this ras also is also vikrit this reflection so that uh, top top most rajya that uh, golok vrindavan has all the kind of five rasa there that bhagwan krishna in full fledged form is just enjoying all those five kind of transcendental rasas in golok vrindavan and we can see that and there is actually no kind of stopping in that no kind of barrier is there but uh, this this material ras is actually all polluted and uh, and it will just be just uh, getting in into the ocean of misery this kind of material ras sarvango diye sarvango sarvendriyo sarvendriyo hai sarvango sarvendriyo dekhar krishna seva just by this uh, the krishna seva is possible at at absolute platform we have to go before that it is not possible to do krishna seva nandan nandan shri krishna seva is only possible at absolute platform and i have already told it previously also this point that in dandakarane rishi munis they actually want to embrace uh, ramchandra in madhur ras 
एंड रामचंद्र जी जस्ट कैन अंडरस्टैंड दैट इट इज़ नॉट एट ऑल पॉसिबल इन दिस लाइफ इन दिस लाइफ इट इज़ नॉट एट ऑल आई एम इन दिस लाइफ आई एम जस्ट बिकमिंग अ मर्यादा पुरुषोत्तम आई एम जस्ट फॉलोइंग वन 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 हजबेंड मैन आई एम जस्ट बी हैविंग वन मूमेन इन दिस लाइफ दैट्स इट एंड वैन आई एल बी जस्ट कमिंग इन द्वापर युग आई एल बिकम गोपी जन वल्लभ आई एल बी कमिंग इन दैट स्वरूप एंड डेफिनेटली आई विल बी जस्ट फुलफिलिंग योर डिजायर्स so this kind of uh, rishi munis they are actually just taking the krip of ramchandra you can see they are just came in the gopi swarup in the vrajdham vindavan they have just got avirbhav there so these all kind of uh, things are already written in padma puran all these things are already written in padma puran someone actually is speaking that in these gopikas this kind of at the starting of the ras ras leela they have just uh, left their body and just came to bhagwan and in brahad brahad bhaman puran also it is written in maha maha upanishad also this actually is there from shri bhagwat ji mahapuran also that all those upanishads are just joining their hands and just speaking in front of krishna that we also have this desire to get under the guidance of gopikas like gopikas we want to serve you gopikas what kind of lotus feet service they have done we also have that desire to serve your lotus feet you just do keep on us we also have this kind of what under the guidance of gopikas we just need to do your lotus feet seva so like this we just want to serve you so like this what happen like this they actually want to do the seva according to their own uh, desire they want to serve bhagwan with their own bhav they want in the vrindavan inside vrindavan with the under the guidance of gopi premavati they want to become gopi and in vrindavan dham they just uh, taken birth there in vrindavan as gopika so all these things are coming there it is just not a normal thing at all lal radha rani lalita vishakha they are uh, in their group just to just to have a name in their uh, group it is not at all possible bhakti mohan thakur ji is writing this that this is possible for them only bhakti mohan thakur this is not a normal thing lalita sakhi in getting the in getting into the group of lalita sakhi and just getting to getting your name registered in the lalita sakhi group it is not at all possible it is very difficult so that's why bhagwat ji mahapuran it is written that shrimad bhagwat ji mahapuran what is written there jad 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 vaishnavanam dhanam and in the other place it is written about that vaishnavanam dhanam vaishnava tilakam that it is the actual this is the actual granth of vaishnav for other those who have jealousy who are actually having false ego who are actually fallen and having very bad character for them this bhagwat ji mahapuran is not at all there bhagwat ji mahapuran is only and only for those pure vaishnav paramans vaishnav that is actual treasure of all the vaishnav apart from vaishnav those who are actually by forcefully they will be reading that and they will be reading that and writing that then they will be going in the opposite direction that's why prabhupad speaking that bhagavatam should not go into their hand because they will be just going and just making money everywhere that's why gaur kishor das baba ji maharaj is just speaking to bimla prasad saraswati that amar prabhu you he is actually coming to you 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 don't need to give uh, actually you don't learn uh, chaitanya ji tamrit etc to him because they don't know they are actually just uh, making one kind of uh, plate of uh, money in front of uh, people yeah, they are actually just like prostitute don't just actually give him this learning of chaitanya ji but every in this material world everything is going on like this they actually just want to just read good chaitanya ji ram in front of people and they just want to get money those who are actually just uh, getting money by reading shastra in the whole infinity life there they will be going to hell for other people okay it is okay but for them those who have actually just making uh, no kind of uh, regretfulness and forgetfulness is there for them so whatever is there
it is from lagu bhagavat amrit we can see that is the top most log that the that the top most place is see radha kundis so by just by getting getting the kripa of radha kripa what is the actual kripa of radha rani that is not a normal thing by getting the kripa of radha rani that is bhagwan krishna also speaking this point that that kripa of radha rani is he was just like bhagwan krishna just like a beggar asking for kripa of radha rani it is actually for what place this kripa is the to get the kripa of radha rani just to get the kripa of radha rani at the place of at the corner of radha kund that at the shri radha kund is the topmost nitya place it is possible to get that by the kripa of radha rani that is the that is the topmost place prabhupad ji speaking that in each and every shastra is also written not prabhupad speaking and rup goswami pad also that the last upadesh what we will actually just speaking from last two days here actually it is written only in one time in the life that a prakrit which are if we're getting inside our heart and who is just taking bath in radha kund definitely immediately he will those that who is just you are not getting by infinity life birth after birth you are not getting that thing you will get that krishna prem which is very very difficult to get but still you can get that by taking bath in radha kund with a prakrit chit vritti in the one one time in the life only i have just propa speaking that this sack of blood and flesh this body propa speaking that this sack of blood and flesh this uh, filthy and dirty body of uh, blood and flesh full of kama and come uh, rog pit vak just made of that this this body uh, filthy body and dirty body will take bath in radha kund how it can take bath in radha kund externally they are actually at the uh, uh, appearance day of radha kund thousands of people are coming oh my god i have just uh, went to that place one one time only i thousands and thousands of people are just from so much kilometer that line of uh, uh, the cars are there and all those material people are just getting into the radha kund and just getting their sack of filthy and dirty body inside radha kund they are taking by and of all the all the four places that mike and uh, uh, will go and that at that tithi at that time where definitely i will just take place here in uh, kum bath just like kum mela they are fighting there to take bath oh no i will take bath first uh, that sadhu actually no 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 that naga sadhu uh, no we will take bath first and like this all actually fighting going on that uh, forcefully they want to take uh, the bath first and that's why they have just taken a trishul and just uh, getting into his uh, uh, into his uh, he is a naga said you see he is not a naga so he is just a murderer this actually filthy and dirty body by this body you will just be taking bath in radha kund if you are having this kind of vichar then what is that it is just opposite wrong prabhu is speaking so the shrimati radha pun that that uh, non different from radha rani that is the actual shastra we are just giving the actual proof and practical proof uh, from different shastra and those different sadhak then normal sadhak we are actually narad ji that is a topmost devotee he is also he is actually very it is very very difficult even uh, narad etc also it is very difficult to take uh, the Uh, take her a place at Shri Radha Kund. That Shri Radha Rani, what this kind of Kund is there? That according to that, who is actually taking a bath in that? Definitely, she will be giving kripa to them who is taking that a prakrit bath in that transcendental Radha Kund. Prabhupada actually speaking that I have taken bath in Kund. 
that I have already taken in bath in Radha Kund. This kind of vichar, what is there? This is actually very uh, filthy and dirty vichar. I cannot. I have just taken a bath in Radha Kund, and where you are getting Krishna Prem? That from all the uh, uh, outside, the, all those seats are actually coming. So what they are actually getting? They are actually getting prema. <laughs> Not at all they are getting grima. So what is the actual meaning? This is the actual meaning that Jeev Goswami Bhad in Sandarbh actually speaking that you see that whatever fishes are there and crocodiles are there, all actually are there in Ganga. Actually all are there in Ganga. So definitely just by taking the, getting the fruit of what they are taking bath in Ganga, the act, there are actually some rules and regulations with full shraddha and confidence you are taking bath in Ganga. I have taken bath in Ganga. Are Raghunath Das Goswami Pad has used to take three times bath in uh, Shri Radha Kund. That uh, Raghunath Das Goswami Pad is, uh, his body is just made of uh, blood and flesh. He is a blue stool and urine in his body. He is just after three days he is taking a bit of uh, yogurt. After three days he is taking and uh, nothing eating and his body is going on and his bhajan is going on that is a prakrit sharir so Prabhupada, this kind of vichar it is very important to understand that i i have just taken bath in radha kund i have just taken bath in radha kund this kind of false ego that this man this false ego this body made of blood and flesh is just a sack of blood and flesh stool and urine and this is my wife i am i am his husband and some kind of which are I am a sannyasi. I am Brahmachari. Sambal actually speaking, uh, Kshatriya, Vaishya, Shudra, like this, this kind of which are when you have, it is impossible to get, uh, to take bath in Radha Kund. This which are, uh, apart from Prabhupada, nobody will give us to them. When this kind of which are is that I am Brahman, I am Shudra, I am Kshatriya, I am King, I am Praja, I am Minister. When you have this kind of bath, you don't have the eligibility to take bath in Radha Kund at all. That with Aprakrit Bhavana only, you just need to take bath in Radha Kund. That I am Brahman, I am Katri, I am Shudra. They don't have any that adhikar of getting bath in Radha Kund. Even that at Aishwarya Marga. Those who are uh, who are, who are having getting the vichar of Ashwarya Marga, even those Ashwarya Marga vichar, that is actually no kind of dirtiness there. Maybe they can get out of that. They are actually all getting out of that kind of vichar. They do. They also can go up to Vakunt, but there in Vakunt there is actually Ashwarya vichar. So fine vichar is there. He has actually uh, penetrated everything and he is actually going to get into Vakunt also. But still, here. In Vakunt, what kind of opulence which are Ashwarya Vichar is there with Ashwarya Vichar? He also has to, he don't have the eligibility to take bath in Radha Kund. Now you can see the Vichar. Prabhupada speaking that uh, even that Ashwarya Vichar also, that he is actually eligible to go to Vakunt. This kind of Vichar, if you are taking bath in Radha Kund, you can't take bath at all in Radha Kund. So you see the Vichar, so in depth, serious Vichar is there. Apart from Gaudiamat and Prabhupada, nobody will give us this kind of vichar. Everyone actually is running for each and every Babaji in Radha Kund. I actually am just giving, take a four to five times bath in Radha Kund just by taking that all black body into Radha Kund and giving all the kind of dirtiness in Radha Kund. You are just taking bath and you are getting prema, no? Nothing you are getting. You go do, okay, whatever is your wish, you can do. If some having that Purusha Viman, Pur Prabhupada speaking that having that Purusha Viman, that this kind of false ego that I am woman, I am actually woman, I am man, I am a boy, I am a girl, this kind of which are just uh, taking bath in Radha Kund, you are not at all having that adhikar to take bath. If you have that Purusha Viman, Purush means, I have already told this point a lot of time, that Purush means, that this... Uh, this that uh, woman in our woman body that body this is actually woman body or whether a man body inside that what atma is there inside that with paramatma sitting there and this kind of false ego have that i am woman i am man this kind of vichar when it is there up till that point to take bath in radha kund it is not at all possible to take bath in radha kund now you have this vichar with that purish body 
विद फुल फॉल्स ईगो ऑफ दैट पुरुष दैट आई एम मैन एंड वुमेन इन ऑर्डर टू सर्व राधा कुंड इट इज नॉट एट ऑल पॉसिबल इन ऑर्डर टू टेक बाथ इन राधा कुंड इज नॉट एज पॉसिबल सो अप टिल वॉट पॉइंट यू विल गो अप टिल वॉट काइंड अप टिल वॉट पॉइंट यू विल गो दैट विच आर एंड ऑल दिस काइंड ऑफ ऑल एक्चुअली फुलिश पीपल आर जस्ट स्प्रेडिंग दिस काइंड ऑफ डर्टीनेस इन ऑल द फोर डायरेक्शन एंड दे आर स्पीकिंग दैट आई एम संत को स्वयं टू स्लैंग लेक विद बाय ऑपरेशन ओनली यू जस्ट कम टू मी आई बाय ऑपरेशन आई विल मेक यू गोपी लाइक दिस संत को स्वयं बना सो फुलिश एंड सो फ्रॉडस्टर दे आर ऑल द फोर डायरेक्शन दिस काइंड ऑफ बैनर इज गोइंग ऑन सो उपदेश अमृत स्पीकिंग प्रोपर स्पीकिंग दैट दैट नेक्टर ऑफ उपदेश अमृत इफ इट इज नॉट गेटिंग इन साइड अवर हार्ट दैन इन हरि भजन ऑल्सो वी डोंट हैव एनी अधिकार फॉर हर हरि भजन सो लाइक जस्ट बाई हैविंग दिस वेरी स्मॉल विच आर आई एम एक्चुअली वेरी अन इंटेलिजेंट पर्सन जश्यात्म बुद्धि कुनपेतिधातुके स्वाधी कलत्रादीषु भौम इजधि जत्तित्त बुद्धि सलिलेन करहिचित जनेषु अभिज्ञेषु स्वइबो गोखरः वांचकल्पतरुषिके बासिन्दु बिच पतितानन पावन भविष्णभ्यो नमः